on this machine with Mesotrol matrix next to CNC. We're gonna see how to uh, diagnose a user alarm. This is our alarm starting 200 and uh, the coil or signal on the PLC is the F0. So let's go to diagnosis. We don't have any user alarm here, but uh, let's suppose we need we would like to check the or troubleshoot the 354, which is a user alarm in yellow. And for the 354, the coil is 154, F 154. So let's go to version, enter the layer monitor, and here we need to check uh, or click a NC file to open the PLC ladder from the CNC to the HMI. It's open, it's all selected. <laughs> okay. So let's go back. And here we have the press monitor. And if you don't have the comments, you can display the comments right here. I already set comment, note, statement. Suppose uh, you want to also show the alias. You can just check the box and hit set. So let's go and look for a coil, which is the F154 for the alarm 354. Let's change the target as a coil and find. Yes, there you go. Let's go back. And here you'll see we have the setup key in on. So this is the setup key on the control panel that I switch. In. And if you have in this condition this signal or any of these branches, it's gonna trigger that alarm. Um, here we have a good example of machines uh, parameters or PSC parameters. What we uh, Mesa does is to have PLC parameters to configure the ladder logic for different machines that uh, you need or different options. In this case, if we enable the RP30.3 uh, and if we have the input X88, uh, 89, it's going to trigger the alarm. So uh, let's check this how to enable the parameter. RB, PLC parameter RB 30.3. So let's go back to the main menu, go with the hit end, and go to, to parameter, PLC parameter, RB, and let's check the RB 30, and bit input, bit 3. So we set the B3 in, a, in one. Uh, if I would like to chain any RB67 um, to, to the RB88, we need to be in a privileged mode. So as you see, I cannot move to that column. So there is another video that shows you how to enable that. So this parameter, if you modify any of them, it will take an immediate uh, action to the signal and this you need to power cycle the machine or reboot this CNC. So let's check the ladder. Diagnosis, version, ladder monitor, NC file, open, open. Okay, let's go back and here let's press monitor and look for the coil or contact, in this case it's a coil, 
and the device is F one hundred yes to continue and as you see now the bit is on so I just need this signal in order to trigger the alarm. Uh, I guess I mentioned but it's not these uh, parameters are on the parameter bits uh, the description are on the electrical diagram so look for your electrical diagram for your machine and you can see probably the the description might give us uh, an idea but uh, in this case there is a um, Set up, set up box, I don't know what it is. So we need to check the electrical light, okay? So let's go back and change back the parameter to zero. And RB30, bit number three. Okay, that's all, thank you.